Welcome back to the channel guys. Today we are in a courthouse parking lot in Massachusetts with a group of Moorish sovereign citizens getting their car towed. But this video isn't just about the towing, it's about the unique claims made by their quote unquote consul general in an attempt to stop the police towing their car. So without further ado, let's get into the video. A uh, conveyance, not her motor vehicle. This is a conveyance uh, under color of law. Yeah, right? okay. We're going to challenge the court's jurisdiction. Absolutely. And yeah. they're going to dismiss it for Does lack anyone, of jurisdiction. Uh, like okay. all in of your the party or anyone that you're with here have, have, have a have license? Resolve this to avoid laws I don't know. You. So he said there that the court will dismiss his right to travel case for lack of jurisdiction, like in all his other cases. Well, that's a massive claim to make because never once have they provided any evidence of these cases being dismissed. In fact, it's just the opposite, with plenty of cases disproving their claims. But they do like to talk a big game in front of cops in an attempt to persuade or even intimidate them with threats of lawsuits, just like he did here. But states are finally cracking down on this type of frivolous lawsuit, and rightly so. No, you have to ask them. Okay. They're not in my party. Well, hold To the Commonwealth Constitution. Standing as individuals. For the United States of You interpret that document to mean um, that this is a vessel. I interpret that document, based on being a maritime uh, major, that that related to the ports of call when Mor the Moroccan government decided to do international travel. Because they travel. wanted to make sure that any time they pulled no. into port, they would not be uh, violated and what, they would be able to... Are you to, referring uh, to the Kingdom of Morocco, which yes. was founded in 1956? Uh, because this treaty is 1836. Mm -hmm. yeah, this is the empire. Founded okay. by the Emperor of Morocco. Treaty of peace and friendship between the United States of North America and the Empire of Morocco. The okay. kingdom is subordinate to the Empire. You're in the Empire. Yeah, this is why they call New York the Empire State. That's where the Emperor sat. A lot of people okay. don't know that history. Your higher ups may do. It doesn't matter. Law doesn't change. Did he really just say they call New York the Empire State because it was where the Emperor of Morocco sat? Yeah, right. So this is what Moors do. They take history, put it in a blender and add a pinch of BS and voila, you've got yourself a conspiracy movie. There is actually some ambiguity around the naming of Empire State, but because it has the word empire in it, like the old Moroccan Empire, they swoop in on it and make up their own history. Okay, that's your interpretation of the treaty. I'm, I'm... They're not talking about... You gonna break my? You gonna break my my my, yeah, it's my hatch? A motor and also, we still have. And stuff plus, in. I mean, okay, but it's one in the front. It's one in the front. It's one in the front. Yeah. Okay. Don't know how to operate it. Um, just ask. Yeah. So a lot of um, police departments and sheriff departments, not most, but a lot, get it confused when they think Morocco. They think over there this uh, uh, northwestern continent of Africa. No, Morocco's here and it extends over there. That's an empire. There is no Moroccan empire anymore, but if there was, then it would be common knowledge to everyone, especially police departments around the United States, and you wouldn't need to carry around your own made-up paperwork every day to justify driving illegally. The only way you can justify your beliefs is for there to have been a giant conspiracy, but there's absolutely no evidence of that. All right. I'm not trying to do, give you a history lesson. I'm just saying that when you read this treaty without the understanding of the history of it, that like when our forefathers allowed you, your forefathers, to do business on this land and it was sanctioned, a Republican form of government, not the state of Massachusetts, but the Massachusetts Commonwealth Republic, that was the sanction and form of government under Article 4, Section 4 of the Constitution for the United States of North America, for you all to come within our dominions because you broke off from King George of Great Britain who was enslaving the colony. Okay. So you all came under the jurisdiction in 1787. From 1784 to 1787, under the Emperor of Morocco, not the king. It became the U.S. in 1776. We've had enough history. No, that's uh, U.S. This land is never okay. U.S. Okay. That's I, birthright, I, I, that you're I, trying to steal I, I, our birthright by saying I'm this. I'm not trying to steal anything, sir. I really am. No, I'm just I'm saying not. that when you say that, I'm, I'm this land is not I'm telling you right now, right now okay, yeah. that this is 
the United States of America. The land? This is the United States of America. Its borders are the United States of America and North America. It is America. not. <laughs> Absolutely. Okay. America. We're indigenous, aboriginal. Okay. Absolutely. Okay. Well, yeah. I don't want to disrespect. Who's the superior? I, and I'm, I'm, just I'm really that's trying to not. That's disrespectful to us. Uh, to I'm say not, that this is the United States of America. No, the jurisdiction. Are you, are you saying that this is not the United States of America? Absolutely. This is Morocco. Okay. We're okay. indigenous. All of us. Look In, at it. We look just like the land. Okay. Interjection. Who's the superior? Okay. So why has every single court case by Moors who claim to be indigenous to America and to get out of a driver's license and to pay taxes been dismissed and labelled as frivolous? So now, now That's this an insult becomes, to us. and no insult to his men, okay? I'm letting you know right now, I work for the Commonwealth of Massachusetts, okay? Who we are within its borders as far as I know. Your claim to this being part of the Moroccan Empire, I guess will be settled in U.S. Supreme Court. No, absolutely. Supreme right Court, no. Settled, no, no it's being I'm not going to settle it. I know. It's okay. being settled here. Yes, I'm going to settle it. It's going to be settled here. Okay. And it's also being settled in other cases. We just showed you. Okay. That's stir decisive. You've, it's you've, already been decided. You showed me affidavits, sir. Affidavits. I showed you orders. No, no. No, they were bonded by okay. affidavits. I showed you orders. <laughs> I like how this cop knows the difference between an affidavit and a court order and then calls him out on it. Wonderful. You requested the order in the affidavit. Did All right. you show me where the request was? Okay. Is? No. Uh, hang on one second. Respectfully. I respectfully, I'm, I'm trying. Let's get this over with. Let's. We have the information. Wait, 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 wait. This is order. Who is it signed by? By me. You, okay. Look, look, no. It was of course it is. No judge will put their name to sovereign citizen paperwork. But wait, it gets even better because he claims to be, well, I'll let him tell you. He is the Consul General. Okay. Consul General let me, Okay. Where, do, do you have a barcode? No. A bar, Why do you, you need a barcode? Bar. What do you need a barcode for? That's the British yeah, accreditation registry? No, yeah, absolutely. No, we don't need that. That's no. the British accreditation registry. Uh, yeah. Okay. We don't practice law. Well, we I only enforce the laws, the statutes, oh, so and the case right. law that is issued by the courts of the and the what legislative branch. Okay. That's where Good. my jurisdiction. That's legislation. You can't legislate our way. And no, I said in the cases and the uh, the cases implemented by our judiciary and the legislation. So you and know any what, executive. You know what case law is used for? To settle, so it's, if it's already been decided in one right, case... Right, but they choose in a court of law. We're not in a court of law right now. We're out here in the back parking lot. And she is exactly right. They are not in court. But there's a reason why they try to hold court outside in a parking lot. And that's because no court ever agrees with them. So the only place where they can get some kind of result is when they gish gallop and wear down cops on the side of the road to let them go. Sometimes it happens and they claim it as a win, but as you've read the title of this video already, you know that doesn't happen today. You that's don't have courts. <laughs> you okay. don't, they don't, they want delegated So tell me, why are you even attending this court if you don't recognise it as a court? Um, we okay. need to talk about it, all right? Thank you. That's grand theft. They're trying to do the same I do not have a card on me, but I am in charge of uh, the uh, state police barracks in uh, Medford, right here, this right district? across the street. Yep. Yep. You got a card over there? I do. Yes. I do. If you come in after this whole thing is over, I'll give you a card. And um, once this thing is over, because you always do a traffic case, right? Ticket. You already yeah, issued her a ticket. Yeah. There'll be a summons for her to appear. Yeah. Yep. She's going to appear right. Here. No, that's, and she's gonna do a special appearance. Nah, I ain't gonna tell you all that. Okay. I'm gonna say it in writing. All right. They're trying to do the same thing with uh, my convenience. Oh, they're challenging you too? Yeah, they, they want to tow my vehicle. Okay. So, uh, well, we got enough fun. That's, damn, that's grand theft. Yeah, it looks like two cars are now getting towed. This car here, they're all standing around. And this one they mentioned just now, which we will see towards the end of the video. But anyway, if you believe this is grand theft, call the police. I'm joking there, but one Moorish sovereign citizen actually called the police on the police for towing his car. Link to that video will be in the description. Oh, 
over there. Came out here. And even more wizards come over there when I'm getting my stuff in the car. All right. Because they they all surrounded. Uh, okay. Hey, um. This is what they intended to do. I mean, I now have to figure out where I'm going to put it. So now that you are trying to tell someone well, you else. Can, you can secure it in the vehicle and it'll stay, uh, the inventory, it'll stay in the toilet. But I don't want you to eat my food and I don't want it to spoil. Um, so, yeah, but I'd like to eat it and I'm pretty sure I it's going to be some. You, I would take my food. Well, I'm, I'm trying to take everything I need. Wait, why would she eat your food? What a strange statement. I mean, I'm, we're, I'm no, like, yeah, I know, I know. Discussion but here. She's Dr. saying Carter. that our team is only a friend. Tell you all that. Okay. Right, we'll say it right. All right. Oh, they're challenging you too? Uh, that's it. Okay. Well, we got enough funds. That's, damn, that's Grand Theft, huh? It just came out here to team of Grand Theft. Hey, um... Go ahead, you get this. Wait a minute, Nasi. Wait, so let's get a closer look at this. So, you claim to be from the Consulate of Morocco, but you've also appointed yourself Consul General and you're pinning all this on your shaky interpretation of the Treaty of Peace and Friendship, which is a trade agreement between the real Morocco and the real United States, which you don't recognise. Yeah, okay. Still, I've never tried LARPing myself, so I won't judge too much. Hey, they're doing the same thing to the brother's car as well, so uh, he's going to need some, somewhere to put his problem. Well, Look at someone else coming in. They're going to be on the outside. They have to be able to pay. So now they're going to be trying to kill someone else. They're going to be targeting all the cars that are going to be paid. And the cars don't win no matter. Well, there's only one way it's supposed to win. That's the whole purpose of who the superior, huh? Who the superior? Her. Yeah, she's in the law. I know. She's claiming that their policy supersedes treaty obligations. So. Fletcher. I mean, we're, you know, yeah, I know, I know, but she's saying that our treaty is only referring to admiralty and ports, which it is, but she's construing the traffic laws that they're enforcing, which is color of law, is the law of the land, which, and, and not admiralty and maritime jurisdiction, which it is. So, I mean, she's incompetent. Does anybody know about council law? Council You've got a nerve calling this cop incompetent when you think it's okay to drive a two-ton lump of metal on a public road without a license, registration and insurance. That's not well, no, no, no. It does. I don't want to. That was not disrespectful to you. Ma'am, no, nobody knew about constitution. That's it's upsetting. You gotta understand where we're coming from. I understand. That's upsetting. We traveled a long way. Can I ask your question? So. Uh, if it's some of the same questions, it's he's already gone. Yeah, just don't, through. don't, bro. We just gotta do we, it we, in their in their well. venue and our venue. That's fine. That's fine. We'll put the call out and everything will be fine. You have to I don't understand. I think it's fair because we travel, I like to travel everywhere. And for you guys to do that in the parking lot, that's not, that's not cool. Hey, bro, they did it peacefully, though. You know what I'm saying? Okay. It could have went a whole nother way. So we're going to keep the peace. And that's not always the case with this kind of traffic stop, especially with how many people are present. This could have gone downhill fast. So props to him for recognizing that and keeping the peace. He's still wrong, but he is doing it peacefully. Listen, this is also an article I would like for you to see, man. This is Article 24, which is what we're doing here. If any differences shall arise by either party infringing on any of the articles of this treaty, peace and harmony shall remain notwithstanding in the fullest force until a friendly application shall be made for an arrangement. 
this is peaceful. We're, well, no, no, no. I know. Yeah. That's I was just saying. That's what yeah. we're doing. Yeah. That's what we're exactly. doing here. Exactly. So we're keeping the peace. You understand? But I it's frustrating. It's frustrating. The things that both of us people, are frustrated right now. Why? You're getting paid for this. Um. Yeah. You're getting paid. I am, for this. I am getting paid. Because yeah, I would assume there's as, no as, as, a, as a representative of the council, you are getting paid for this. Yeah, there's no, no. We're getting violated from this. There's no injured party. If she's violated, I'm violated. All of us are violated. Yeah. And all our convenience is no, our private trust. That means anybody violate our trust. And if there is no warrant, which is authority, to search or seize, then you can't you operate outside of that uh, uh, realm of law by your decision or by arbitrary or by color of law because that's what color of law is. That means there's no injured party. There's no affidavit. There's no one claiming to be the plaintiff, which is the one who makes the complaint. Not state you of Massachusetts. You're vehicle in Massachusetts. You, you have you, to have you're a saying, I, I heard that narrative, okay. however. But it's not a narrative, is it? It's the law that you need to abide by in Massachusetts to operate a vehicle on a public road. Just because you don't like it doesn't make it wrong. The plaintiff is going to be state of Massachusetts or oh, Commonwealth, yep. Commonwealth of Massachusetts. Mm -hmm. That means no one has the right to face their accuser. Who's the accuser? Who's gonna get on the stand and say, I so swear to tell the truth? Right to the, uh, no, 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 no. No one corpus is gonna come up there in the individual capacity. You all are going up there in your corporate capacity. So liability won't reach you in that corporate capacity because no one is standing to take liability to be the injured party. All, if there's a case, controversy, there's supposed to be an injured party, either by contract or by uh, uh, criminality. So show me where in law does it say the state cannot be the victim? Or where in law does it say there needs to be an injured party before the law can be applied to you? I'll wait. All right, there is no criminal uh, uh, activity here. We're traveling and we're peaceful. However, I don't want to sound redundant because you may have heard this before, but I'm one of the ones that ride around with stir decisive meaning other cases that I've assisted Moorish Americans with enforcing the Constitution and Treaty, not local law or state law, all right? That was under the Articles of the Federation of 18, okay. 1781. Yeah, but that's, 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 that's legislation. That's corporate. That's the that part of the first part. Because you said uh, a code. You said a code. Constitution is to uphold the statute and judiciary and executive orders of the Commonwealth. And all treaties. And all trees. Those are legislation. Yeah. Those are legislation. You're right. Your common legislation. They are. And there are laws. So under 9010, you need to be licensed in the state of Massachusetts. Yeah, but we don't. That's if we have a contract with you. We're not contracting with you, so we don't have to abide by that. Can you imagine if that was the case, that the police or state need you to sign a contract before they can apply the law to you? It would be absolute chaos on the streets. Because you're not sovereign over here. Saying that's your defense. But right now, we have to deal with the criminality. And that is criminality. I know you already explained that. Okay. 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 Okay.
course, it's not going to accept it. I mean, whatever you want to do with it. No, 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 we need this. Yo, anything they say, okay, and it will be used against them. Sir, can you take a little bit of time? Yeah, we need this. This will be made into an exhibit. Watch. Okay, ma'am, the tow truck is going to be ready to come to you. We're going to request soon as he is suspended. Yeah, we're, we're waiting for the command. Oh, okay, okay. Thank you again for your patience. Can I get a couple of witnesses to come with me? That's not a bad idea, actually. Let's all head on over and witness the car getting hooked up to the tow truck. I mean, that is why you all clicked on this video. And to listen to me ramble on. Right? No? Green bag too. Where you got, sir? You alright? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm my backpack. Okay. How can you put my car? Are you gonna give me can a you get my bag too? My green bag. I get, I get my, my stuff in the back too. It's really important. You want that? Medical stuff? Medical stuff. It's the right there. Is that backpack that you don't? Hold on, hold on. And that's where this video ends. As always, I will be keeping an eye on this channel, so make sure you are subscribed for future uploads. Thanks for watching, guys, and take care.